There are five stages while reading an Abby Jimenez book. Stage one, it's the beginning. It's cute and funny and it is reeling you in. Stage two, the tension is killing you. Could this slow burn get any slower or any burnier? Stage three, they're together. It's all hearts and flowers. You've noticed that colors are deeper, everything's sharper, and you hear romantic music at all times. Stage four, tragedy strikes. There's a breakup. You vow to yourself that you will never read Abby Jimenez again. Stage five, the epic finale. Everyone's happier than they've ever been. It's the best Abby Jimenez you've ever read. You put the book down and begin your countdown for next year. Are you looking to read or rediscover some of the best contemporary romances around right now? Do you want to do it with friends? Then welcome! I've read and reread her books so many times and I was so excited when several of my friends and I got together and decided to do this read-along. For those of you that don't really know Abby Jimenez, let's talk a little bit about why I'm obsessed. Her books are full of slow burn goodness, open door but on the lower spice end. Her cinnamon roll heroes are yummy and delicious. There's always a big bomb that goes off, but there's also an epic finale that just makes you so happy. The characters are so real and relatable. It's humorous and fun, but also dramatic. The other thing that I find so fun about her that I don't see in a lot of contemporary authors is the way that she leaves little Easter eggs and cameos from one book to the next. And as we do this read along, we are going to be exploring all of those things. So who's going to be co-hosting with me in this incredible read along? Tara of Tara Talks Books, Kehlani of Kehlani Simply Me, Karina of She Dreams in Words, and Dana of Dana Ella. Some of us are reading these for the first time. Some are rereading them for the bajillionth time. I love reading them physically, but I also am in love with the narrators that she gets for her books. Oh my gosh, especially Zachary Weber. Oh my. We'll be reading one book a month, skipping December because we know how busy that month can often be. We'll be kicking off the fun September 8th on my channel, Mama Needs to Read Romance, at 4 o'clock p.m. Eastern Standard Time with the first book she ever publicly released, The Friend Zone. Then then on October 6th, on Karina's channel, She Dreams in Words, we're going to be doing the Happy Ever After playlist. On November 3rd, we'll be talking all things Life's Too Short on Tara's channel, Tara Talks Books. As I mentioned, we'll be taking December off, but then we're going to be starting the Part of Your World series over on Kehlani's channel, Kehlani Simply Me, on January 5th. On February 2nd, we'll be talking all things Yours Truly, Dana's channel, Dana Ella. March 2nd will be Just for the Summer, and sometime in May, or perhaps the first weekend in June, so everybody has plenty of time to read it, we will be talking about Abby Jimenez's brand new book. And obviously there's plenty of time to figure that out and make sure you're aware beforehand. I just can't wait to get started. I hope you'll join us for all the fun. Thanks so much for hanging out with me. I hope you enjoy whatever you're reading, whether it's Abby Jimenez or not. Until next time, take care. Bye.